getting Linux computers for the students at their school. Depending on the need, all of those actually work. But one question that will come up is, what will we actually do with the Linux computers at school? Oh, and people will also ask, are these computers hard for PCs? I'll answer the second question first. No, they're not hard for PCs. In fact, we have kids as young as kindergarten using Linux to ask them. But what do teachers actually have kids doing with Linux at school? We checked around the building to see what activities and apps kids are using for Linux. Kindergarten and first grade. Our kids in kindergarten and first grade have been learning and having fun using a Linux app designed for younger students. G Capri. G Capri is not a game, but a package of a dozen games and activities designed to help kids develop and also keep their skills. Memory, strategy, and a lot of other things. And pretty much all of these support the learning that students are doing in their core academic subjects in class. We just introduced it earlier this year, and it's been a big hit. Audio recordings were all that audacity. Students in 7th and 8th grade tech class had learned how to use Audacity to make audio recordings. When we got to Black History Month and Women History Month, several of these students wanted to apply what they learned in tech class to assignments and social studies. These students used Audacity to record and edit their history project. That was fun. Poster creation with the LibreOffice. Students this year did a building-wide campaign about being better students. They used the LibreOffice draw to make the posters because the tool had a lot of great features but was still relatively easy to use. Online textbooks. In some of our class, we have adopted the use of e-textbooks in order to save money and make more resources available to students. The sixth grade more than life textbook for Minnesota history is a great example of this. Rather than buying hard copies of textbooks, we bought a subscription to the electronic version. This required us to make sure the grade six teachers had steady access to devices. We set up a cart of Linux devices just for him and parked it in his room. 100% use devices recycled with Linux, they are cheap, problem solved. Google Workspace. For anything a teacher would want to assign through a Google Classroom, our teacher is a Google Workspace for education, for education school, which gives teachers and kids access to a wide range of tools for learning. Google Docs, Sheets, Slides, Forms, Drive, and a Google Classroom to tie it all together. These tools will work on many browsers, but works best with Google Chrome. As luck would have it, same way that, as luck would have it, Google makes a version of Chrome for Linux, which makes these tools work exactly the same way they would, would on any other platform. Use Google Docs to make digital worksheets, use Google Slides for reports, use Google Forms for quizzes, it all works on Linux. Online, online learning platforms. Google Workspace is not the only thing that teachers use for learning. There are so many online learning platforms that our teachers use to challenge and teach their students. At our school, kids use ISL, Amplify, RainPub, Discovery Education, and ABCI. And all of these sites have something in common. They all work on Linux, just the same way they work on any other platform. Standard, standardized testing. There are so many things school wants to do, and some things they have to do. Schools are required to test students on reading, math, and science. They are required to test language progress for English language learners, and some schools want to give their, test book, the kid, give their kids a test voluntarily to check progress throughout the year. Linux can be used for all of that. At our school, we have used Linux for the MCAs, the access for ELLs, and FastBridge. And it just works! As you can see, Linux and open source can be used in class to further a school's learning goals. It isn't just something you stick into the tech class or after school clubs. It can be used everywhere you want students learning. Thank you.